God bless you, brothers and sisters. My name is Stephen Young, and I'm the VGR Office Manager in Durban, South Africa. I'd like to give you a brief update on the coronavirus situation in our country and on the measures being implemented by our government in order to contain the spread of the disease. As of Friday, 27th of March, there are 1,170 confirmed cases of coronavirus in our country. During this time, most businesses in South Africa were forced to shut down their operations. But by the grace of God, we managed to supply our translators with sufficient manuscripts in order to keep the work of the Lord moving forward during the lockdown period. We've also received reports from pastors and believers from around the country regarding the state of the believers. And by the grace of God, not a single case of believers being affected by the virus has been reported. We thank the Lord that the token is holding true in this hour. The government has since implemented a nationwide lockdown in order to combat the spread of the virus. The lockdown began on Thursday 26th of March and will continue until Thursday 16th of April. Over the next 21 days, South African citizens are required to remain confined to their homes except for essential purposes such as purchasing food or medicines. It's interesting to note that just before the lockdown began, Brother Keith and I completed the latest segment of our Agapo distribution trip in South Africa. It's just amazing to me how the Lord, His timing is always so perfect. Just before the lockdown begins, thousands of tablets were placed with families in our country, in their own language, in Zulu and in Xhosa. You know, those are the two languages which have been approved in our country thus far. So we can be assured that during this lockdown period, many homes will be listening to the voice in their own language. You know, I'm so grateful to be a part of this wonderful work. So even though the, the diseases are affecting people outside, I want to encourage you, Shanes, just hold on to the message. It, it's a gross darkness upon the peoples of the world, but it's shalom to the bride. So my message to you is shalom, peace. Stay with the message that we have heard. May God bless you.